A Fry to Remember As I sat in a fast food restaurant, eagerly waiting for my order, I couldn't help but notice the bag of fries that had fallen to the bottom of the to-go bag. They looked so lonely and forgotten, as if no one cared about them. I felt sorry for those poor little fries, and I couldn't resist the urge to take them home with me. Little did I know that those discarded fries would change my life forever. As soon as I got home, I opened the bag and picked up one of the fries. To my surprise, it started to talk to me. Hey there, the fry said. Thanks for rescuing us from that lonely bag. We thought we were going to be stuck there forever. I was shocked, but also intrigued. I picked up another fry, and it too started talking. Soon, all the fries were chatting away, telling me stories about their lives in the fast food restaurant. I listened intently as they spoke of their dreams and aspirations, their loves and losses. I was amazed by their depth of character and the richness of their experiences. It was as if each fry had a unique story to tell, and I couldn't get enough of them. Days turned into weeks, and weeks turned into months as I sat at home talking to my new fry friends. I had become obsessed with their stories, and I couldn't bear the thought of ever losing them. But then one day, disaster struck. A gust of wind blew through my open window, scattering the fries across the room. I watched in horror as they rolled under the couch, behind the bookshelf, and into the corners of the room. I knew I had to act fast. I gathered up all the fries I could find and put them back into the bag. But something was different now. The fries didn't talk to me anymore. They were just ordinary fries. I realized then that the beauty of those fries had been in their stories and the way they had come to life and shared their experiences with me. And though I would never forget those stories, I knew that I could never recapture that moment again. From that day on, I learned to appreciate the little things in life, the ones that we often overlook or discard. And I knew that, in their own way, even the most ordinary things can have the power to change us forever.